Yeah. Just talk, talk to me about that situation. Oh, uh, when you were at work and the plane hit the Pentagon, this is what was going on with you. Right. I was at uh, Pentagon City. Uh -huh. One stop away from Pentagon. Oh, uh, day 911. The taxi happened. And uh, I was throwing out my chiller point and saw the plane coming around. Washington Boulevard. I got in my truck. Headed, headed up Washington Boulevard. You'll see the plane coming by the time I got the rod. Boom, I see the smoke. I didn't hear, I didn't hear the crash, but I saw the smoke. So I, me and my partner, we kept on riding, kept on riding. We made it back to the shop, man. You know something, busting off. Now we got back to the shop. The gas tank on the, on the plane exploded. Shook the building. All brick buildings shook it. We like at least 12, 13 miles away. You can still feel it. The rumble. All of a sudden, they get on the radio. They start telling the police, emergency business, about hitting people. Cause they jumping up on the sidewalk because all of the, all of the streets are jammed up. Everybody trying to leave DC. Everything. No phone systems. There was all the phones are jammed up. Back then, they didn't have digital. Right. Everything was right, right, right. right. So by the time we got back, everything was a mess. Everything was clogged up. All you see was like shut down because of traffic. It took people like six, seven, eight hours to get home. Sitting in traffic. You know, everybody trying to leave at one time. And after that, they, they made an emergency plan. You know, they got an extra plan to get everybody out of there. It takes time to get that in. Oh, oh yeah. It wasn't in place at that time. At that time, they didn't come up with that. That time was after, after nine months. They had a general change of communication system and everything. So couldn't nobody call me. Then we saw people running from the Pentagon because they kept hearing, you know, every time they see a plane, they thought another, they thought another one was coming. So everybody would run, you know. So you had people just running in the Pentagon parking lot. You got a plane stuck out, half of the tail stuck out in the back. Right. You know. Next morning when I went to work, the plane was still sticking. The tail was still sticking. They can't get out much. But when they hit, when they initially hit, there was no explosion until after a while them tanks heated up and boom, that's when you got the explosion. It took everything. Everything. Wow. Yeah. Uh-huh.